Red Queen 7 and welcome back to Rule of Waves 3 as we continue our adventures as Spain. And first and foremost, a happy new year to everyone. Although I realise in hindsight this is actually the second Rule of Waves video out this year, as the other one went out on New Year's Day. But that wasn't New Year for me when I recorded it, so this is a heartfelt happy new year to everyone out there. Uh, secondly, for those with keen eyes and vivid memories, uh, you'll notice that we left the end of the last episode having somehow theoretically broken the blockade and you see as we reload the game we are in fact being uh noted as being blockaded by the french which is actually how it should be and you see their blockade strength is 74 uh, which is over the requirements of minimum 72 and at least 110 percent of ours which is obviously very very small uh so this is this is right we and i did query it i remember in the last episode for why we weren't blockaded so the game's fixed itself upon a reload uh, but not for long, let's see, I think a couple more French ships investigating the bottom of the sea, and we should be grand. Uh, one other minor note of admin for you, so just a hello to our new captain, Griswell, who has joined us, and by sheer fortune of the fact I forgot to give out the Asturias somehow in the first round of things, you find yourself in command of one of our... Uh, of our better ships at the minute, so congrats. Um, okay, speaking of ships, we've actually both our battle cruisers are laid up at the minute. So the the Andalusia's she's got one month repairs, and Mysterious has got two months left. She had hit, I can't remember if it was a mine or a torpedo from an event. So she, I think she was out for five months, which ironically I don't think I've ever seen battle damage last that long. But hey ho. Um, so we're a little bit thin on the ground with with ships at the minute. Only for a month, so that's fine. Uh, one th thing I may do is actually pull my battleships out of Northern Europe and stick them in the Mediterranean. Because um, our blockade strength is so low, it's not going to make a difference. Uh, hang on, let me just deal with that beep beep. I don't know if it came through. Okay, there we go. That should be that fixed. What was I saying? Ah, yes, yes. We don't have um, enough strength in our own ships for really to make a difference. You know, we're never going to... Uh, but yeah, even if we did, right, by the time we have 100% uh, or within 110% of the French value, uh, they're going to be less than 70 to 72 anyway, so it doesn't really matter, right, unless we are, our fleet was over 72, we could get an edge. Um, and they're a bit of a liability, so I may pull them both out and stick them in the Mediterranean as well for a bit of safekeeping uh, and also actually act as a little bit of early naval superiority if, we break the, if and when we break the blockade, or not if, just when. Uh, to do some more naval missions in the Med. So let us do that. So we shall move you down to the Mediterranean. Um, a little bit risky on their own. We will have to keep an eye to see if the French move a force down there. They don't really have any destroyers. And in fact, mm, I should move some down because that does impact the likes of your uh, submarine events. However, having said that, we do have a whole bunch of corvettes here, uh, 14 of them. So our ASW in this area is actually going to be relatively good, yeah. Okay, so we'll leave it as is. If France moves a force down, we can respond. Good. Aside from that, yeah, 1930, uh, running out of money, so our new battle ships may take a bit of a delay, but I think I'd give France another kicking like we did in the last episode, or if, we had, if we'd finished the, the beating we were giving them, obviously the CVL somehow got away on, while being under gunfire. Um then I think we are ripe for taking a large chunk of stuff from them. Right, that's a lot of talking, let's move forward. We've got an enemy coastal raid in northwestern Spain, so our limited air forces can get involved. Uh, we have a lot in the area. Let's see what we get. Okay, Vara del Rey, which, uh, yes, yeah, is correct, I'm a northern European commander. Uh, exceeds the command check, so we can tweak things around. So, oh, it's another aircrafty one. Just an aircraft we won. Well, this is interesting. So we should start relatively far apart. Um, he hopes. Ah, uh, no, I don't think I can. Can I? I don't think I can add random ships. Oh, well, I'm not going to be able to add anything that's not. It would fit in a carrier division, which we don't have any of. But Adel Bear CVLs on its way back. Uh, I could maybe give you an extra destroyer. Yeah. Uh, and I don't suppose I can do anything here? No. But fine. Okay, well, let's. We can bring a destroyer, so let's bring a destroyer. 
Uh, let's bring one of our new ones. But Legaza herself somehow made it in here. Uh, and this will have to do. Except, this is a little bit... Um, no attack ships. A little bit... Scary, in that... We get a couple of bad bits of weather. Or... Oh wow, you've got a lot of bases playing, playing things out here. Or if we get... If we, we don't want to bump into them. Uh, right, time of day. Three hours. So we're just going to be hanging about for three hours. Uh, I don't know where they're going to be attacking. So nothing, nothing too obvious. Uh, what's our current scouting? So we think the enemy is over in this direction. Okay. Uh, let's tweak this. I don't need you to be that's the right one. We don't need to scout there, I don't think. Right, I think that's... I suppose it's fine. Our distance of 300 is okay. Cap. Yeah, we'll keep it medium. We're going to try and stay out of the range of their bases. Don't really need a night cap. I don't think we'll do a night search either. I don't even know if we have any night capable aircraft. I think that's okay. Plus we'll get a search from the base as well. Okay, you do that. Uh, and then I suppose we'll ready up. A bunch of torpedo bombers and dive bomb. In fact, we'll just ready up a whole bunch of people, right? And I'm also going to grab hmm, what and who and why. If I, uh, I want some escorts, I'm not going to be able to get it from everyone. Uh, so let's ready you guys. It frustrates me that this bug has cropped up in this game. I really, I'd rather put you on. I was gonna put you on mediums, on heavy bomb load, but your bomb load is the same. I need you to die bombs. You guys are rubbish. <laughs> uh, okay. Right. Uh, so like you guys ready? Ready, strike. Uh, and then I'm gonna select some fighters. Oh, but I can't change the column because of this daft thing. So I think we're just going to get, we'll just get one whole wing as escorts, but the problem is that, uh, do you know what's fine? You guys both escort, the CV will provide cap, well maybe even request land base cap, I can't remember if we've got any fighters here. Uh, but I do want some escorts, so ready you guys, exit. Well it's going to affect our spotting, but that's fine. Uh, did I only get one of my divisions of destroyers, where's the other one? Um, are you all you just sitting on top of each other? That could be it. Another thing we will do is we will request land base cap. Again, I don't know if I have any. I don't know if this tells me. But if we do, they'll come and lend a hand. Okay, good. We're just going to stay close to our shore here, near the port of Gijon. And we shall see what we can see in the next couple hours. Uh, and just pray the weather doesn't get any worse. Worse. Okay, you guys are getting ready. That's fine. Don't have anyone for you to go just yet. Okay, so some more air formations ready. Uh, ultra fast, fast. Probably pretty good. Head along here. It's 20 knots. Should be fine. Still okay for plane ops. We're just waiting for dawn. And also for any uh, reports of our coastline coming under fire. Uh, what? Uh, nope. <laughs> I don't want that. This is not good. Oh dear lord. Oh dear lord. Okay. Uh, so you have spotted it. Yeah, so which is, I think you're part of the coastal forces. Do, do, do. Oh no. 
You're mine. You've been broken off. You think damage? No. Don't know why you're not in a division. So this actually okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to take control of you. Uh, oh no, I can't. All right, I'm not sure why I can't. If you were one of the coastal forces, I would understand that. But as you are under my main force, I would expect to be able to take control of said destroyer. I'm going to run a couple of minutes so you can get a bit more of a contact on what this is. Meanwhile, let's increase you guys up to squad max. Just to get a little bit of distance between you and these forces. We've got destroyers to screen our retreat if required. A couple more. I mean, I should, maybe I should just hurl the planes at them. Yeah, do you know, it's probably a batch of destroyers. He says, hopefully. Uh, we may not get much out of this, but I think that's enough for us to be hurling our air attacks. Uh, lightning bolt. Uh, honestly, just go back there, I think. Nautical Miles is so close. Let's, we'll go a little bit further. Uh, let's do all ready. Where are we? Flight ready. I suspect we're well over our uh, spotting value. To lose you. Uh, no, let's let's send in the old hammer ambles. We've got torpedo bombers at the same time as dive bombers. Oh, it's still too many. Okay. All right, we're gonna have a wave one and a wave two. Launch. Um. I'm assuming, in fact, you know what, I'm assuming this is not, I'll leave the, the fighters, but I'm assuming this is not a CVL. And they're really close, so I'm going to say, look, let's not do coordinated strikes. Which is a risk of higher losses, but surely they haven't come in here with a light carrier. Right, let's run out a few minutes, and then we're going to uh, select ready, which should be everybody else. A few people are already in the flying, but anyway. One strike, no, 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 no. Okay. Would like someone to find a little bit of scouting for me. Can I control you? I can. Beautiful. Okay. Congratulations. You are now a scout. Roll. I'll even change your role officially. There you go. Uh, I can't. Great. Screen. Whatever. Come along, Terror. We've got some spotting to do. Is it? Is it really a battleship? No, light cruisers. Is it okay? They are taking fire at my destroyers. Um, the only thing that concerns me is they may manage to depart quickly enough. Take the bait. <laughs> Hello. Uh, four dive bombers in first. That's somewhat surprising, but okay. Why four? I don't know. My, my strike groups are definitely bigger than that. Okay. Now, these are also going to be harder to hit. Being more nimble ships. Uh, Miss Destroyer in here is getting hot shot at. that. Right, come on, lads. Oh, you're launching torpedoes. You're doing well for an AI controlled vessel. And you even hit one of your three inch guns. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Um, yeah, I'm going to keep you going where you're going, actually. That's fine. Okay. If you hit one, it'll be uh, pretty amazing. Oh, look at that for a, for a tor torpedo salvo. Salvo. Quite tasty. Right. Where, where are you guys going? You flew over the top of them. Uh, it looks like they're all going to miss. Yeah, they did. But still, you launched. That's usually what we ask. Oh, and you're launching more. How many torpedoes did I put on you? 
Oh, and you're starting, you're starting to find the range and you're going to take damage, unfortunately. That was a close one, but it was a miss. Um, you guys are still going as quick as you can. Where are my planes? Well, I can see them. Escort. Escort. I don't know what you're doing over here. Where's my torpedo bombers? This destroyer is now taking a few few beatings. Okay, looks like they're coming in. Here we go. Uh, okay, apparently, first thing to come in are some of our four dive bombers, and these are our torpedo bombers. I mean, well, we're gonna lose this destroyer, unfortunately. Uh, let's see, three dive bombers dive in, no aircraft hits, no aircraft hits, no bomb hits. One final dive bomber, doesn't get shot down, no hits. Four torpedo bombers down, no aircraft hits, which is good. I'm not getting any torpedo hits though, apart from... Ah, Rodent Destroyer. I suspect that's from their destroyers rather than from our planes. Well, I wouldn't give for a cruiser right now. Come on, hit those light cruisers, please. That's our win condition here is to sink some of these light cruisers. But we need to, um, the Terror to come back. More pl planes coming in, which is good. Uh, no, no. Crazy interest in, in the log, though. More planes coming in. We lost an aircraft to HA8. Okay, nothing more from that wing. They're all fairly scattered, though. And we did see uncoordinated, which makes sense, but even then within the wings, they're coming in in kind of two parts rather than one big one. Eight, nine more to be dormers coming in. Another seven, this is better. Another five, okay. No aircraft hits there. Aha! And we've hit. We haven't had a battleship as much as I liked it. That'll be one of the light cruisers, though. Oh, and two bomb hits as well. Good job, dive bombers from Goma. Okay, that's good. We're claiming is this one here. There's one torpedo and a couple of bombs I've put into them thus far. Uh, Peria class gets hit by a torpedo. Uh, do you know what? I'm going to get with Terror 2 lay smoke here just to try and protect himself a little bit. And that looks like a very, very wounded... Oh, I was going to see light like, cruiser, but there's only a couple here. Oh, well, there's only the two. Okay. Um, yeah, you guys are still heading along the coast. You need to get yourself much closer to Feral, to be honest. Any more airstrikes coming in? Are we all on the return journey. Oh, there's the Peter Bombers there. Look, they are on a strike. There they go. Ha! And we hit. No, that's our own uh, ship again. Again, I suspect that's from them as they go past rather than from our own torpedo Bombers. But you never know. Eight more coming in. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Two aircraft damaged on after having dropped their payloads. No more torpedo hits, so we've got... Oh, well, looks I think one fairly badly wounded and one not so badly wounded, right? Things I should be changing here. Uh, not in this one. In this one. Uh, reduce my cap, I don't need it. We're just spending time picking up aircraft that we don't really want to be. So these fine gentlemen are getting rather close. 
Right, show me by... Just got a reasonable number. I don't care about odds and sods. Let's give me everyone who's over three. Okay, we we're already starting to get some new groups for a return. That's one advantage of them being so close, I suppose. Quick turn around. Right, lose the fighters. I don't need them. We could theoretically... Oh, no, they're kind of any bomb load. Eventually, fighters can also do kind of light bombing type stuff. But anyway, this will do it. We will... Ready my strike. And we'll send them out again. We might have to do a, a destroy charge of these light cruisers as well, because we're getting unfortunately close. Maybe one more minute. Two. Okay, maybe it was just the two formations. Uh, no, there's one more to come. Done. Okay, who's ready? Like ready. It's fine. We're gonna. I think you guys like here. Just go for it. Um, I'm going to say yes this time. Just per carrier. So it's only really these two guys will go together and you'll still go on your own. But it's something. And then everyone who's unready. You're a fighter. I don't care about you. Dive bomber. Dive bomber. Get yourself ready as well. And I think we're going to have to do a store screen here. Ilk. Sixteen North Camels. This is not the distance you want to be at. Uh, who are ready? Select ready. One from each, so no point in coordinating. Oh, so I try that again. No coordination. Launch strike. No. There we go. Right. So we've got one more bite of a cherry and then potentially a bit of a destroyer charge to see if we can't finish a few people off. Are oh, you about to turn to launch perhaps? Okay. First ones are coming in. So what I'm going to do now is grab one of our uh, destroyer divisions. Lots of torpedoes, excellent. We're going to come up here, control. And we're going to head over this way, and we're going to go into line ahead. And we're going to see if we can't take out this light cruiser. Ha ha ha! Got you. Perfect. So, torpedo bombers from the Komon. They seem to be having the experienced air uh, wings here. Yeah, right, so you need to keep in contact. Okay, no more bomb hits there. Uh, oh, hello, though. There's two bomb hits on a different CL, so that might be the already injured one. Uh, okay, someone's killed a merchant. That's upsetting. And an unsighted torpedo hit. You guys going squad max? Yeah. Yeah, that's no, just 30. Okay. In fact, I think it's actually 27. Okay, so it's like a fairly slow destroyer. Uh, slow light cruiser here, which is good news. I don't know why you guys have come back. I guess it's the wind. I don't know why you've come back. I just wish you hadn't. Uh, do we have anybody left? Actually, actually quite a lot. Our, our, our op losses here are not that bad. There's one more cruiser at least out there, so let's get ourselves ready. We might be out of torpedoes, let's see what this is. Ready strike. Oh, you're good. More torpedo bombers going in. Uh, a bomb hit from one of our dive bombers.
Okay, so we've got a cruiser, two destroyers, and one cruiser on their own. Okay, first formations, I'll wait till there's a bunch of them ready. There's a few more. More. What else getting ready still? Nope. We're going to select ready. Can we park them all? 17.9, it looks like it. We're going to go... I think we're chasing you, so I'm going to say come up this way. I'm going to go after that light cruiser there. Go for it. No coordination. Every pilot for themselves. Yeah, terror's going up. A little bit hit here. Oh, nice torpedo launch there. I'd like to see. Ooh, close one. I'd like to see my AI captain's taking a bit of initiative. Uh, I kind of want you to stay in touch for long enough for the planes to get here. More torpedo launches. I don't think we're going to do anything, but still. I applaud the, uh, the intent. We're continuing to put pressure on the Descartes class here. Of one escort. Not seeing much in the way of hits though. Like most of them are aimed at the terror here. Let's see if we can't try and box for the land in a little bit. Just to keep her in the in the area my planes are expecting to find her. Well they may end up going after the day cart here. Uh, I'm gonna get you guys to hold torpedoes for just for now. Okay, first planes are in. I think they're coming after this one. No hits though. Terror is sinking. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay. I did, I did risk her a bit too close to the, the land there. Where are you guys going? That was weird, that was almost like you were avoiding torpedoes there. Which you may well have been. Right. And we would very much like the Descartes as a prize. I feel like she's wounded enough we can kind of take her down. Fortunately these Next wave of attacks aren't up to too much. We're reporting heavy. We are reporting heavy damage. Fifteen knots. Can't quite get out in front of her though. Actually, what we want to do because now you guys have made a reasonable distance now. I'm going to be bold and I'm going to strip off your remaining. Destroyer screen. Finish essentially your import and head you over here. To try and get a little bit of extra help. As we shepherd the Descartes, hopefully to its doom. A near miss there on one of our destroyers. So you have to watch yourself. I'll see the light cruiser's guns will do a number on our little guys. Really, we just want to keep pressure on, keep our shepherd, and then perhaps we'll bring in. Some other guns, although the Leland might make life difficult for me. But I'll be upset if we don't get out of here with having sunk something. My real hope is that she is currently flooding. We've hit the Descartes, but she's hit us back. Uh, okay. Right. I think this is where we say you can fire torpedoes and hopefully we get a nice big volley. Oh, lots of Hits from our 5-inch guns. That wasn't great. More Descartes hits, a couple of 5-inch, 4-inch. Oh, she's spinning and managing to dodge every single torpedo we put in the water. That's frustrating. Oh. Oh, maybe. Yeah, oh, she's dead in the water. Okay, good, 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 good. 
Hold to purify. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. All right, we have got ourselves at least one light cruiser. Let's go back to our formations. Again, ample people ready for service. Uh, I might leave the three. Maybe just four or bigger. Torpedo dive bomber, torpedo bomber, torpedo bomber, dive bomber. Ready strike. We. I'm interested to see, because um, you'll still let me do this and say ready strike, won't you? No. What I really need to do is right click and change you to bombs, which, and you can have heavy bombs. But I'm going to get this error. Ah, <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Or well, we can do... We do unready. We can actually, you know, we can turn them to heavy with that button. I'd forgotten about that button. This one here. Do you guys, who else is unready? Your fighter. You're unready. And you're unready. And we do all heavy. Hmm, it's not doing it. Okay. It's not what I wanted because you've put you got you've put them on lights, but sure, that'll have to do. Things you gotta do when the game's working against you. Cool, right. Enemy aircraft? Or maybe there's CVL out here some well there has to be a CVL here somewhere. Ah no, it's um airships. Which is fun. Dog. Right, what are we finding now? A lone destroyer. Okay, lots of information is ready. Question is... Oh, yes, yeah. Where do we send them? I don't actually have a great handle on where they currently are. I'm going to clear the current reports uh, just to remove all the little blue flags and hopefully help us out f see what's there. Now, are you leading me to Villa Land or someone similar? Hmm. I don't know where you're going actually. Why are you guys all split up now? actually kind of irritating because I don't really want to control you individually. It's far too much like hard work. Keep one of you as a scout though. Uh, what time of day are we at? Yeah, it's going to be night time. Do you know what? I won't even, I'm, I'm not even going to send my pilots out in the night. There's only one ship with one light cruiser with sunk. What? Hang on, are they shooting something along my coast? It was down here they were interested in, so let's go and have a look. Uh, I think that's the destroyer. Even that could have been a transport they were engaged with. Oh, okay, that seems better than here. Well, it's also getting pretty dark. Well, cool. okay. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna hang around just in case they make an appearance. But I don't even know what I just selected there. I think this is going to be the end. So, uh, well, like, we'll run to a thousand. See if that ends it. Yes, it does. Okay, cool, excellent. We did indeed get one light cruiser. Ah, the one that got away, and two destroyers. 
Ooh, I'm interested to have a look at that. Uh, we did lose two destroyers. So really, we only came out one light cruiser ahead, which is not phenomenal. But it's okay. Hang on. Sorry, what? Oh, you want a raid and you sunk two ships. Oh, oh, oh. Fine, he says. Fine. Um, okay, the, this was our Descartes class, which didn't he take... I just one torpedo. I think it was an air torpedo. Yep. From the Como. Uh, no bomb hits, no missile hits, no anything. We have the Isley here, who took, again, just one torpedo out, and she almost died. I'd love to have found her. This one was from the Atlantia. No. The Claymore here. I actually get hit by a torpedo from the Atlantia. And then the Sapi, see, what do you call it? Got hit by a torpedo from the Atlantia. So despite all the claims from a number of captains, uh, or pilots, I should say, from the Comon especially, most of it seemed to come from Atlantia. Where were bomb hits? So, I, you, you, how many did we see? Maybe five or six bomb hits recorded. There was one, one actual bomb hit on the land, which did almost nothing because my attack bombers are poor. I really need to get them replaced. Okay, it's it's okay. Marginal victory, fine. More importantly. Less less cruisers because I think they now will genuinely ooh, money. Thank you very much, Parliament. Be under the blockade allotment. Allo allotment allotment. The blockade number. The Teflon has sunk an enemy sub in Northern Europe, um, and they're raiding me in Northern Europe and sunk one merchant. Okay, fine. And Japan adds some victory points, which actually overturns the very minor deficit we had from that battle. And now we are uh, officially. Not blockaded, wow, by quite a lot. They've moved a the fleet somewhere. They've moved their fleet somewhere. Here, one CVL, two CLs. I think it's a little time to do more naval invasion malarkeys. Now, we don't have superiority in the Mediterranean. Uh, I think we want to aim for that, but we could try and do a quick one. Out here, they have no ships. They've got a corvette. is the only ship they have in the area. No one are close by? No, and of course, Japan's got a bunch of ships here. Well, one light cruiser, but we've got plenty of the other bit. And no French ships there. We do have three light cruisers in West Africa, which they would probably divert over. Uh, where are our heavy cruisers? South Africa. Sorry, lads. New plan. You get out to Southeast Asia. I really want Tunisia to take Tunisia in a, a naval invasion, but I'm concerned that if we plan it now, they redivert a bunch of forces from Northern Europe, and we just can't get naval superiority in the Mediterranean. But we definitely have it in Southeast Asia. I'm not sure they're going to commit that big a fleet. We'll divert our heavy cruisers to go and support the Sisney and her destroyers. And I think we're going to plan to invade. One of these. Annam or Chochin China. I think we can only get a Nam actually. Yeah. Awesome, let's do it. Set invasion target. Close. Cool. Um and then let's take a bunch of people out of Northern Europe, because who needs to be here? I thought I moved you to the Mediterranean last turn. Clearly not. You're already in the med. Uh I mean Uh, we, yeah. What do, we want? How, what do we want to leave? Is the humming and hawing I'm doing right now?
I'm just going to leave some light cruisers for just now. I may tweak things a little bit, but let's get everyone into the main, most of our forces into the med. You're in South Africa. Oh, don't be. Uh, Puerto Rico, do I want you to support South Asia fleet? We've got a couple of light cruisers they could bring, which I'm not really scared of. And that's about it. No, I think I'm going to bring you into the med. Uh, we'll leave you four in the Northern Europe. Adelbear. Let's bring you into the med for just now. I'll bring you into the med. Measure in South Asia, which is fine. You are heading to Northern Europe, which we're going to change in a minute. Let's get all the stores into the Mediterranean, apart from those which are under repairs. Okay. Awesome. Now the real fun begins. So they still outnumber us. Um, not crazy, but still a little bit. They've got a couple of nice battleships where I'd like to sink. Battle cruisers, actually, they don't have any left. Uh, they're trying to build a CV. And they're trying to catch up on CVLs, which is okay. I don't mind about the near battle. Uh, light cruisers is the one thing which we want to keep sinking. And we're whittling, we are slowly whittling them down. More fights in the med would be good, but yeah. Let's maybe try and we can maybe nab a nam and then we'll switch our attentions to Tunis. Once we've eradicated, we would hurt their fleet a little bit more. Because if they moved everyone into med, we just wouldn't have super superiority, even. We did, right? Uh, no, why don't I have enough foreign stations? Uh, ba ba ba, air overview, who's missing? Foreign station requirements. Tonnage, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. Ooh, the South Pacific are somehow neglected. Have I got to spare one of you? Oh, no, I've got, I've got one in the South Pacific. Oh, I read that in reverse. My bad. You've got eight. You've got also oh, Caribbean, I'm sure, one, actually. Okie doke. Do I have a 600 spare? I don't think I do. I've managed in all my faffing to end up short. Okay. You are, ah, uh, you are there, but you are being repaired. So you'll actually be fine next turn. Well, I'll just quickly slap you onto foreign stations. Okay. Uh, all right, we're going to have to call someone here before I click the next turn button again. Oh, should we do a sneak preview to see if we get in a battle and I'll save it there? Okay, let's do that. We can end on a bit of a cliffhanger, perhaps. Or perhaps nothing will happen. Convoy defense. Um, I don't want to fight this. And I've got one CL, one CV. They've got a battle cruiser. Which I thought was being repaired, but okay. Four CLs, two AV. And I'm just getting two light cruisers. And we expect they have a CV, three CLs, and some destroyers. Hmm. We'll get support from land based air. We could potentially add a ship. No. No, nah, it doesn't say just re rearrange. What would it cost to decline 600 VP? I think we should decline this one. Not that interested. A cruiser action. <sighs> I'm not, it's going to be a CL versus a CA. I can, I can tell already. So fine, we'll give him another 300. Convoy defense. This is the one we want. This is what we want. Large battle. Don't care about battleships, but we've got a cruiser. We've got a couple of CVLs. We've got our land-based air. I think that was right. A couple of choices to say no to that. Oh, hello. Okay. Bees, we've got those. CVL data. Where is... Aha, we do have the Andalusia. Excellent. Take it the uh, Asturias is not available? No. 
Oh, he's failed. Ultimate Regressal fails command check utterly. I hope you are disappointed in yourself. Because I very much so am. Uh, now, we will have some French planes out of Tunis, which is fine. Okie doke. I accept. And some minefields. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I think we do want to attack enemy ships in general. So we will have to deal with, make sure we've got cap up for this. Ooh. Yeah, we've got our two, two CVLs. So we've got a fairly um, moderate naval air force. In fact, oh, you've got two sets of two sets of planes, potentially three. This could get this could get messy. And you've got an air base in there. Man, I need to get Chinese ace up. Okay. This is this is kind of fine. Uh, we've got dawn in thirty five minutes, right? But we're going to come back to that next time. I think a lot of it might be older ships and things hiding in the in the Bay of Calgary. They can jump into port if and when they take some damage. Cool. All right. Well, thanks for coming out and uh, watching this, and I'll see you on the next one. Cheerio.